Let's face it, security isn't always top of mind for most businesses. Often productivity and ease of use will trump everything. And that's probably why you're watching this video. You're most likely concerned about balancing security and efficiency, especially with the lurking and growing threat of shadow IT. What is shadow IT and how does it affect your business? You'll find out after watching this video. Hi, I'm Rick from the Managed Technology Channel. Having managed the technology of small and large companies alike for over 20 years, we believe that cybersecurity and operational efficiency go hand in hand to achieve business success. That's why in this video, you'll learn what is shadow IT? What are the risks of shadow IT? What can you do to slow shadow IT? What is shadow IT? Although it could seem ominous, shadow IT isn't always malicious. Shadow IT just means the use of unauthorized or unapproved technology and software within an organization. In other words, it happens when employees adopt applications, devices, or cloud services without the knowledge or approval of the IT department with no ill intention. Let's say your production team decides to buy software to improve their process and they don't tell anyone. There's no risk in that, but a year from now, that software malfunctions and it is too late for your IT team or MSP to resolve it because, number one, the software is unsupportable, and number two, they didn't even know you had it. Shadow IT can include anything from unsanctioned software and communication tools to personal devices used for work-related purposes. What are the risks of Shadow IT? The intention may not be deliberate, but if your IT team doesn't know about specific software, they can't secure it, and that's where the risks can escalate, leading to Number one, security breaches. Unvetted applications and services may lack robust security measures, making them vulnerable to cyber attacks. Number two, data loss. When employees use unsanctioned cloud storage or file sharing services, data may not be adequately protected or backed up. This increases the risk of data loss due to system failures, accidental deletions, or security incidents. And three, compliance and regulatory issues. Shadow IT can result in non-compliance with industry regulations and data protection laws. Failing to adhere to these standards can lead to severe penalties and legal consequences for your business. What can you do to slow shadow IT? There's really no easy way to get rid of shadow IT in your company. However, there are ways to mitigate how prevalent they become inside your organization and prevent problems from happening in the future. Here are some of the things you can do. Number one, acknowledge that shadow IT is a problem. The first step to solving it is to acknowledge that it is a problem that needs to be resolved. You can't get rid of shadow IT if you turn a blind eye to it or encourage the practice. You need to accept that it conflicts with your security efforts and that there is a better way of improving your team's productivity with the help of your IT. Number two, educate your team. Promote awareness about risks associated with shadow IT within the organization. Explain to them what shadow IT is, the security dangers, and why you need the support of all employees to help plug the security gap. You can even incorporate all of that into your regular cybersecurity awareness training. Number three, leverage shadow IT to your advantage. In addition to educating your team, ask them to collaborate with the internal or outsourced IT departments on the apps they believe make them more productive. Gather insights on what parts of your system need improvement, which alternatives might work better, and which ones are easiest to use. By creating an environment where employees feel heard, they are less likely to seek alternatives without approval. Given time, you can determine if those tools are secure and effective so you can officially deploy those that are enterprise ready, or IT might be able to identify safe alternative tools that meet your employees' needs. Strengthen your cybersecurity. Ensuring you have a robust cybersecurity posture should be a top priority for any organization. Make sure to include the following. Establishing a clear and concise IT policy that outlines approved applications, devices, and services, while including guidelines for data handling, security protocols, and consequences for policy violations. Implementing monitoring and analytics tools to track network activity and promptly detect any unauthorized applications or services in use. And conducting regular audits of your organization's IT infrastructure to proactively identify and address potential instances of shadow IT, preventing them from evolving into major security threats. 
Now that you understand how shadow IT can affect your business, you can start educating your team on how to leverage it to your advantage. If you need more help securing your network, download our ebook about the three types of cybersecurity solutions your business must have. As always, I'm Rick from the Managed Technology Channel. If this video helped you out today, please like it and subscribe to our channel so we can grow and help other business tech users like yourself. If there's something on this channel that you'd like to see, comment down below. See you next time.